Hey guys, Tonic here. Another Tuesday, another Atomic Shop review. This week in the Atomic Shop, we just got the Wildwood Den Bundle for a thousand atoms. I just picked it up, so let's go check it out. So first up, let's take a look at the brand new prefab, the Wildwood Den. This thing is pretty sweet. It does raise out of the ground and sink, so I can go ahead and place this on some uneven terrain really without any issues. We're going to place it right down there. And then it does come with a door as well, which I don't believe was in the Atomic Shop listing. But just walking around the thing, it is so cool. It kind of has some chain link fence kind of windows, some really nice little window blinds, very tall ceilings. And heading inside here, you can just see how much room is actually in this thing. There is plenty of room to place things. If we go ahead and go over to like crafting, we can place a ton of workbenches in here, make an entire crafting area. Even if you want to place some like decor, like wall decor or some very tall plants like this, they will actually kind of clip into the angled ceilings there. So you can see the top of the plant is kind of clipping in there. So there really won't be too much of an issue with placing items in here. And I just really like this prefab. I think it's really cool. Next up in this bundle, we do have a brand new bridge set. This is the old set right here that we've had for a very long time. This is going to be the brand new one. It's just a covered version of it, and I kind of do like the look of that a lot more. So let's go ahead and make a bridge here. We have a front end piece, and they do snap together. Then we also do have our middle pieces if we want to extend the bridge. So let's just throw a few of these on there. Then let's throw this on there and end it. This is really cool. I love the bridge sets. They're always really cool to see in camp builds over like ravines and stuff like that. And this one is just awesome. I can't wait to use this. I kind of wonder if we can use the other pieces with this as well, which I'm not too sure why you would want to, but we'll take a look here and see. So it looks like we can actually. So if you do want to add the other piece on there as well, you can. And then another thing that I want to see is if we can put stairs on there. So let's go over to the stairs and try and snap them on because on the older set, you couldn't and you kind of had to place it low to the ground or even with whatever ground you wanted to put it on. And it looks like we cannot put any stairs on this one either. So stairs will not snap to it, but it will snap to the other bridge set. And for the last brand new item in this bundle, we have some new defense walls in the form of hedges. And these are really cool. So we have a short green one, a longer green one, and they do snap together. So we can snap that that way. We can also even snap it at a 90 degree angle for some corner pieces. Then we also do have some dead grass. We have a short dead grass one and a longer one. Now they do sink pretty well, so like on this little slight incline here I can kind of have it floating or I can sink it into the ground and I can even snap the live green one to that one. So these function really well, they look really nice and I can't wait to use these in my builds honestly, these are pretty sweet. And so at this point in the video I always like to go through the entire atomic shop for those that work and just can't get on right now to see everything. So on the front page here we have the brand new items, then we also do have some lunch boxes, repair kits and scrap kits on sale. Over in the utility room area, we have all the stuff from last week. Over in Greatest Hits, we have a Fallout First Limited preview. This is going to be good from November 9th to the 16th, and it's going to include a scrap box, a survival tent, as well as a mechanics wallpaper and floor. So if you don't have Fallout First and you want to give it a try, go ahead and get this. It's pretty awesome. You will actually be able to fill up the scrap box. Then even after this limited preview runs out, you can still get the scrap out of the scrap box, which is super cool. So maybe this week, just go out there and grind a ton of scrap and try and fill that thing up. And then going on here, we have the Bomber Jacket Bundle, the Communist Collectron Station, the Fajnok Collectron Station, the Raider Collectron Station, and the Normal Scavenger Collectron Station. Then over in Vaulting, we have some of the Halloween stuff heading out. And in Special, we have the Let's Nuke Emote for free. We also do have the Blue Core Vega Trailer, 250 caps, a Scrap Kit and Repair Kit Bundle, and the CD Shed is still here. And so as far as my final thoughts and review on this bundle goes, I really like it. I love the price of this bundle a lot, especially considering the past few bundles that we have gotten have been getting up to like the 2000 atoms range. You get like bundles that are 1800, 1500, and 2000. And this one comes in with some great items at 1000 atoms. That is just such a good deal. The prefab is phenomenal. I really like that prefab a lot. The hedges, I can't wait to use. I actually have a camp that they are going to fit perfectly in right now. And then also that bridge is really cool. However, a lot of camps realistically don't have a use for a bridge unless you have like a ravine or some really big thing that you want to cross. So I would assume that that bridge set is probably going to be the least used thing in this bundle. However, it's still really nice to have on hand unless you ever do want to build in an area with these kind of things. Now also the rest of the atomic shop this week, it does have some pretty good things. The Halloween items going away, that's going to be your last chance to get them till probably next Halloween. So if you do want them, I would recommend to get them. And then also in the returning section that Fallout First preview is super cool. Again, get that, fill up the scrap box, and then once the preview runs out, you can still get all the scrap out of the scrap box. So try and pack that thing full as much as you can this week, and then you'll be set on scrap for the next few months. 
But that is pretty much going to be it for this video, so I do want to say thank you for stopping by and watching, and as always, I would like to give a massive thank you to all the channel members, Anna S, Playmaker, Fallout McFly, Networkgate, Golti, Indica, Robert Kennard, Wandering Wastelander, Esdeath93, Lanthar, Anna Reesties, Captain Awesome, Citizen Girl, Chad of Fallout 76 Podcast, Heather Henderson, Patrick Ruta, 23 Icefire, Jay Smith, Argent Deer, Bowser Double Frying, Ice Cream Manny, Chris Decker, Theodore, Digital Aardvark, Lone Samurai OG, DFN Gaming, Christy Mellon Schwitz. You guys are amazing. I love you guys and have a great day.